Extracting data from the internet can be incredibly useful. It can help with your research, APIs, applications, databases, and more. In many cases, you might be interested in scraping this data into a Google Sheet spreadsheet to allow for easier access and sharing. We are Parsub, and today we will use a free web scraper to extract data from a website to Google Sheets. For this example, we will use Parsub, a free and powerful web scraper that can extract data from any website. You can download Parsub for free through the link in the description or at parsub.com. We will extract data from Amazon's search results page for the term computer monitor. We will then extract this data onto a Google Sheets spreadsheet that will be automatically updated with the data we scrape. Now, let's get scraping. Open Parsub and click on New Project and enter the URL you will be scraping. This page will now render inside the app. Once the page is rendered, a select command will be created by default. Start by clicking on the first product name on the page. It will be highlighted in green to indicate that it has been selected. Click on the second product name in the list to select them all. All product names will now be highlighted in green. In the left sidebar, rename your selection to product. You will notice that Parsub is now pulling each product's name and URL. For now, we will keep our scraping project quite simple. However, if you want to scrape more data from Amazon, such as product pricing and details, check out our guide on how to scrape Amazon product data. Just click on the card that is on the screen right now. You can now extract data from Parsub to Google Sheets. However, you might want to schedule your scrape to pull data onto Google Sheets on a schedule. Please note that project scheduling is a paid Parsub feature. To schedule your scraping project, follow these steps. Click on the green Get Data button in the left sidebar. Click on the Schedule button. From the dropdowns, you can select how often you'd like to run your scrape and at what time. Once you've set up your schedule, click on Save and Schedule. Now, your project will run automatically at your scheduled times. A new tab for the schedule will be created on the Get Data page. You can click on this tab to open a page where your data can be downloaded. You can click on this tab to open a page where your data can be downloaded after the first time it is scheduled to run. Your data will be available in Excel and JSON formats. Next, we will go over how to automatically extract your results to Google Sheets. Here's how to set it up. Go to the Settings page of your project. On your Settings page, you can find both the API key and project token. Save these tokens, as they will be needed later. Open a new Google Sheets spreadsheet. In cell A1, type in the import data formula. Between the parentheses, Enter the following URL that is on the screen right now. We will also put it in the description for easy copy pasting. In the URL above, replace project token with the actual project token from the settings tab of your project. Do the same with API key. Once you've finished up your formula, your data will be auto-populated once you run your scrape at least once. To do this, use the green Get Data button in the left sidebar of Parsub and click on Run. You now know how to automatically extract data from any website to Google Sheets. If you run into any issues while setting up your project, reach out to us via the live chat on our website and we'll be happy to help you. Thanks for watching our video. If you want to learn more about web scraping, check us out at parsub.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos on web scraping, data, and the internet.